There were many reasons why I rode my bike across Canada, but the main message was for millions of people that are suffering in tremendous pain and silence to reach out for help. My name is Ryan Phillips, and I started playing hockey at the age of two. Well, I left home at 16 to pursue my dream, and all I ever wanted was to be an NHL hockey player. So like my greatest dream turned into like my greatest nightmare. Because I was a rookie on the team, because I was a first year player, there was initiations, there was hazing, there was bullying. PTSD about the whole deal has, has got me more now. While I was playing professional hockey, I also became involved in the marijuana business. I was apprehended by the FBI with 103 pounds of high grade marijuana in the year 2000. I was sentenced to two years in prison in the United States of America. I used my time in prison to reflect on everything that had happened. When I was told that I had bipolar, it was a tremendous shock to me. I was in denial for a long time. My life started to spin out of control. I decided to reach out for help, and when I did, it was readily available. Today, Ryan Phillips is in Moncton. He left Victoria June 1st and says it's been an emotional trip. Perfect. Oh, no, I thought you were No, what? The message I have for people around the world is if you're suffering from any mental health disorder, please reach out for help.